Here I got uh, the old uh, Casanova, Michigan Avenue. <laughs> Raz, right out of the chute. You know right. I upload these to YouTube. Absolutely. Good to see you. Good to see you too, I've buddy. tried finding you the last couple times down here, but right. you know how it goes down here. Yeah, we were missing each other. I got, the, I did get messages, you know, and yeah. it took me a while to get your number though, so. Okay, now uh, getting right to, cutting right to the chase, you, you got a lot of female attention. Yeah, I did. But this isn't anything new, I mean. Why, why, is it? Why would you say that? Well, because what changed now from a 15 minute interview from the rest of your life before I uploaded it? I, uh, I guess apparently um, I am uh, good looking. I guess for most it's hard to say that, you know. Um, but confidence is key, I guess. But no, the, it's, I don't know how to take it. It's a little overwhelming. Yeah. Um, but when 80, 90% of the uh, people who have uh, commented uh, <laughs> all are saying the same thing, yeah. then I guess there is some truth to it, you know? Yeah. <laughs> so, uh, I won't beat it to death, but good for you. <laughs> so besides yeah, that... thank you. And thank you for all the comments. Yeah. Like I said, I really don't know how to take it. It's been a little bit, oh, a bit overwhelming, but it's not bad. Yeah. I don't know how to take it either because it's never happened to me. <laughs> right. <laughs> So, uh, like back to your daily uh, right. lifestyle. What's new since the last time I saw you? I, not really much has changed. A lot of the same. i um, kind of glad the holidays is over, you know. Yeah. Um, <laughs> it gets a bit stressful, you know. Uh, but once that's over, the holiday spirit tends to bring a good mood. But when you're out, out here doing this, you know, it, yeah. it, it's a lot of dread, though. So, but um, other than that, um, I actually have... Uh, Taking the opportunity with uh, doing this interview and, and reading a lot of the comments and stuff like that, uh, I am, um, I finally actually did pull the trigger and I'm on a waiting list to go into a program here. I won't say the name of the program, but I'm, it's one that I've been to and it's one to my liking. It just has a pretty long waiting list. So. Oh, best of luck to you. Yeah, thank you. Good. And uh, the drug use up until now, about the same? It's the same, okay. man. Yeah. You know, uh, from the different women that I interview, you know, they've been getting locked up left and right. Uh, right. What, what's going on down here with that? Uh, the police are out here, and they're heavy. Um, they used to never really um, mess with, I'd say, the, the, the girls in general or anybody, and they're just stopping everybody. They're stopping everybody. They're hauling girls in left and right. They're, they're taking the, the Johns. They're taking cars. Um, and it's blue and white, and blue and white, you know, not hating on you guys because I don't want no problems, but they, they usually are no problem, man. They just drive around, they do their job when they take a call. You know, other yeah. than that, they're not, they don't, they didn't mess with nobody, but that's not true. Um, and the problem with that, and for the girls, is they definitely know everybody. So it's very easy for them when they say, okay, we want to clean this up or stop this or prevent this. As soon as you step out, they can pull right up on you, especially on Michigan Ave. <laughs> yeah. You know? Yeah. So it just amped it up a little bit, that's all. Yeah. Mm -hmm. There was an article in the paper, the feds may come down here and try and clue, clean things up. With the boom of the downtown, which is what, you know, I just ended up out here. I don't know if we went over that on my last interview. I'm from further down from the corridor and from downtown. That's where I've been, you know, getting high and street hustling on and off for the last 10 years. Yeah. Um, I've only been out here in Southwest off of Michigan for about a year and a half, but with what's going on, obviously the feds are not going to come in until at least the locals have a chance to do their thing, you know, and yeah. then once that doesn't do anything, then obviously it, it goes up. But with the surge of downtown and with them running out of room and coming all the way up Corktown and through Midtown and mm -hmm. even up East Pass Eastern Market, you know, in the casinos and all that, they're, they're going to clean up. Eventually it's going to work its way out here. You know, yeah, yeah. they don't want they don't want this the drugs and all. They want this hidden from the world, yeah. man. <laughs> okay. You got any questions for me? Um, no, not really. Good seeing Other you again, than, man. <laughs> man. No, I have your number now. Yeah, so. I, mean, you I guess we're both hard to get a hold of sometimes. Yeah, and no, I'll be here for uh, <laughs> probably another couple days. Oh, cool. Well, so I'd good, like to run into you. Again. Good talking to you. Absolutely. Thank you. Yep. All right.